Hello everyone. Our today's topic is early bell stage, which is the third stage of tooth development. We have already studied about the birth stage and gap stage. So next, let us proceed to early bell stage. See bell stage of tooth development. There is histo differentiation and mor and morpho differentiation that is taking place in the bell stage. Okay. Now, it is divided into two. That is early bell stage and the advanced bell stage it is in the bell stage that the shape of the crown is determined whether the tooth has to be incisor canine premolar or molar it is determined in this stage only now see what happens is we have already seen that in the birth stage after the birth stage when there is ectomesian camel condensation and increased mitotic activity then what happens is there is invagination of the uh, invagination of the enamel organ and it divides into two layers that is inner enamel epithelium and outer enamel epithelium so as the uh, the uh, epithelium invagination depends okay so this invagination it uh, gets deepened so what happens is its margins continue to grow its margins jo margins hai ye grow karna start kar dete hain its margins continue to grow and they assume a bell shape okay so as they continue to grow they are assuming here a bell stage bell shape now in this phase what happens is there are some transient structures which are seen in the enamel organ and uh, th there are some transient structures which are seen in the enamel organ Okay, so what are the transient structures? There are five transient structures seen. One is enamel cord, enamel knot, enamel septum, enamel navel, and enamel nick. So, let us see what are these. First of all, why are they called transient structures? Because they disappear before enamel formation begins. okay so therefore they are called transient structures because they disappear before the formation of enamel matlab enamel formation ke shuru hone ke pehle ye log disappear ho jate hain so what are the transient structures first is the enamel knot okay so what is enamel knot it is formed due to the condensation of cells in the center of enamel organ theek hai enamel organ ke center mein there is condensation of cells so this leads to the formation of enamel knot now what is it what is its function it acts as signaling center as many cells express many growth factors so ye ek signaling center ki tarah act karta hai सेल्स जो हैं ताकि वो अपने ग्रोथ फैक्टर्स एक्सप्रेस कर सके ओके सो फर्स्ट फंक्शन इज इट इज एक्टिंग एज अ सिग्नलिंग सेंटर नाउ सेकेंड इज इट इज इट एक्ट एज अ रिजर्व वॉयर फॉर डिविजन ऑफ सेल्स ओके सो ये एक रिजर्वायर की तरह एक्ट करता है फॉर द सेल्स टू डिवाइड ओके एंड इट इज आल्सो वेरी इम्पॉर्टेंट इन डिजाइनिंग ऑफ टूथ कस्प ठीक है सो देर आर थ्री फंक्शंस ऑफ एनामल नॉट व्हिच इज प्रेजेंट इन द सेंटर ऑफ द एनामल ऑर्गन व्हिच इज फॉर्म ड्यू टू द कंडेंसेशन ऑफ सेल्स first is it acts as a signaling center so that the cells can express express their growth factors okay second 
since there is condensation of cells in this place it also acts as a reservoir for the division of cells then third it is also important in designing the tooth cusps so these are the three functions of enamel knot which is present in the center of the enamel organ and this is the first transient structure which is seen after that is the enamel cord see what is enamel cord it is just the vertical extension of enamel knot so enamel cord is the vertical extension of the enamel knot now next is enamel septum the cord extends see vertical extension we have seen now if this vertical extension it is extending and it meets the outer enamel epithelium this okay so if the cord is extending and meeting the outer enamel epithelium it is dividing the stellate reticulum into two parts okay so this is what is enamel septum now next is see this is suppose this is enamel knot its vertical extension is is enamel cord and if this vertical extension is going and meeting the outer enamel epithelium it is enamel septum now after that next is enamel navel so what is enamel navel it is the outer enamel epithelium at the point of meeting it sometimes does what it shows a depression which resembles the umbilicus okay so when it is extending now see when the septum is extending and meeting the outer enamel epithelium sometimes here the outer enamel epithelium shows a depression now this depression resembles the umbilicus so this is known as enamel navel okay so these are the four transient structures which are seen in the bell stage early in advanced bell stage may before formation of enamel begins these structures are seen now next is enamel nicke so what is enamel nicke it is the apparent structure which is seen in the histological sections of cap stage and bell stage okay so this is seen in histological sections of cap stage and bell stage here what happens is the enamel organ it seems to be attached to oral epithelium by two dental lamina see here there is one dental lamina by which the enamel organ is attached to the oral epithelium but in enamel nicke what happens is the enamel organ it seems to be attached to the oral epithelium by two dental lamina okay now one is buccal and the other is lingual which is separated by an area see if we see the side view okay it is like this the single enamel organ it is being attached to the oral epithelium by two dental lamina one is buccal and the other is lingual okay and in between these what happens is there is a mesenchymal tissue in between the two extensions there it is filled with mesenchymal tissue now what this is just a transient appearance it is not that ki truly attached nahi rehta hai do extension se it is just an appearance so why does this happen it this is seen because the dental lamina is a sheet of cells with irregular depressions now we have already seen that dental lamina kya hai cells ki sheet hai and isme irregular depressions hote hain okay so because of this what happens is kabhi kabhi aisa dikhta hai it is just मतलब इट इज जस्ट सीन इन द हिस्टोपैथोलॉजिकल सेक्शंस दैट द इनामल ऑर्गन सिंगल इनामल ऑर्गन इट इज अटैच टू द ओरल एपिथीलियम बाय टू डेंटल लमाइना एक्सटेंशंस वन बीइंग द बकल एंड द अदर इज लिंगुअल सो दिस इज इट अबाउट द ट्रांजियन स्ट्रक्चर्स व्हिच आर सीन इन द बेल स्टेज कैप स्टेज और एडवांस बेल स्टेज